Coming to Africa for me has been a dream since I was a kid. You know, to be here in Africa and experience the diversity of the game, everything that this place has to offer. You know, as my second trip here, it, it was an entirely different mind-blowing experience to me. The diversity of this area of Limpopo really surprised me. I mean, I was in lions, elephants, rhinoceros. I had bush buck and yala, kudu, giant buffalo. I mean, this was as wild as it gets. I mean, we absolutely hunted hard every day. And that's, I enjoyed that. The last time I was in Limpopo, and I'd seen a number of water buck, and the more I saw them and the more I hunted around them, it, it just became a hunt that I wanted. The easiest way to describe my water buck hunt was, it was my African experience. I don't know if it'll ever be top. So we've come to an area along the river here. We're gonna walk a bit along in here. There's a bunch of little pockets and ponds and they typically see a lot of water buck and kudu. So we're gonna hop out here and just kinda work our way all along this edge here through the thicker brush. So let's go cut one off. We get down in the riverbeds, and it's again kind of in my wheelhouse of ways I like to hunt. On foot, in your face, thick brush, working our way along the riverbed, come around a corner, and here's a big male elephant standing in the riverbed eating reeds. You know, to, to be coming down the riverbed and see that bull elephant standing there, and we kind of got off to the side and kind of snuck around a little bit closer to get a closer look. And about the time that we came out into that more open area where we were able to see him, he clearly saw us. And when that animal threw his ears up and put his trunk up, he had the don't mess with me look written all over him. Beyond anything I ever dreamt about as a kid, it all come full circle. To be standing there with an animal that majestic and beautiful, looking down at me, I mean, it, it made me think in the moment of how small everything really was to me. That's fun. <laughs> Get your heart rate going, eh? That's amazing. Amazing. Majestic, huh? Big. Well, and then this the atmosphere too, you know, I mean, to just, to be out here hunting and just get sidetracked and here's a big old elephant in the riverbed right below us as we're stalking around looking for kudu and water buck. Another day in the office. <laughs> nice office. <laughs> nice office, yeah. So we kind of back off the elephant and give him a wide berth and, and he goes off, off out of the river bedding up into the brush. And we kind of come along and keep hunting up the river bank. And we're up the river a couple hundred yards from where the elephant was and Clinton kind of stops and says, I can smell water buck. And we go up the river and we're going slow and keep going and all of a sudden I could just tell by his body language he tensed up and put the sticks out and got down real low and, and turned to me and just said, there's, there's a really nice water buck on the other side of the river. Chris, I saw the, we saw the, the water buck is in the thickets down there. Let's do a small stalk. I'm gonna put up the sticks. And once the sticks are up, he's not gonna give you a lot of time. Okay. Okay. Yeah, they've all been fast, let's go. Okay, 
Stay here. Let's go. Chris is coming down the river here. When you get your second shot, take it. See him, I see him. Now you got him, Chris. Now you got him. Good shot, you got him. Yeah, he's just come down. He's in the water there, Chris. Well, good shooting. Only one thing now. I'll have to go get him for you. <laughs> You know, after we shot the animal, to be sitting there and have have Clinton say, here, get up on this high spot. You need to watch for crocodiles or any other movement on the banks up above us or below us here. And you need to be our eyes and ears. When, when he got onto our side of the river and we were dragging him up, it was at that point I realized what I'd done as far as how big that water buck was. Um, he was way, way bigger than I thought. <laughs> That is a wonderful trophy, my man. That's a wonderful trophy. It was a good stalk. Shot placement perfect. I think you couldn't have asked for a better trophy. You really hunted them hard. The remarkable animals, you know. To be here and see as many of them as we have and some really, really big ones that we've made a play for too. You know, water buck wasn't necessarily one of the ones that I'd really, really always had in the back of my head until the last time I was here and I hunted them and I saw quite a few and then this time we've just seen such unbelievable trophies. And I mean, this one is just absolutely, just breathtaking. When I was a kid and I dreamed of coming here hunting, I mean, that was, today was the, the icing on the cake, man. I mean, just to be coming up that river bottom and come around the corner and there's a bull elephant standing there and water buck and kudu running everywhere and Inyala and Impala and just all the different animals. Couldn't ask for more. <laughs> Thank you.